Hey guys, it's Roy from Wayscript. So you have an email that you want to send to multiple people. However, you don't want to CC all of them and you want to make the email feel personal so they read it. You can take the tedious route and send each email individually, or you can use Wayscript and do it much faster. In this tutorial, I'm going to create a program to send out customized emails to quite a few people. Specifically, I'm going to ask people on an email list to get coffee with me. Here's the email list I'm using, and it's located in a Google Sheet. Column 1 has people's emails, column 2 has their first names, and column 3 has their last names. Your spreadsheet can contain more columns with different types of information that you want to use in a customized email. The reason I'm using a Google Sheet is so that I can update my email list in the Google Cloud at any time and have my Wayscript program automatically reflect the changes. Let's get started. I'm going to build my program from scratch and call it Custom Email. I now want to drag in the Google Sheets module to access my spreadsheet. I'm going to select the Google account my spreadsheet is located in. Next, I'm going to select the mode to read file. I'm going to choose the sheet email list from my Google Sheets. All of your spreadsheet data will appear in the output section. Now, we want to create variables from these outputs. I'm going to assign each column a name. I'm going to call the columns email, first name, and last name, respectively. After you assign names to your columns, the data will appear as variables in the variable section. Notice how these variables are lists, since they contain multiple elements. To access each individual element in the list, I'm going to drag in a loop to my recipe. In the loop settings, I'm going to select all the variables outputted from the Google Sheets module. To send our emails, we are going to use the Gmail module, so I'm going to drag one inside the loop to send an email to individual email addresses. I will select the Gmail account I'm going to use and make it send emails. For the inputs, I'm going to enter the email address I want to send my email to. I'm going to use my email variable. For the content of my email, I will fill out the subject first. Since I want people to grab coffee with me, I will write in coffee chat for the subject. For the email body, I will ask for a coffee chat. This is where the neat part comes in. I can reference variables by using the variable name surrounded by brackets. So in this email body, I will say, hey, open bracket, first name, close bracket, do you want to grab some coffee with me soon? Best, Roy. When the email is sent, the first name variable will be replaced by the first name associated with the email address. That's it, your program is complete, and all you have to do now is run it. Your custom email will now be delivered to everyone on the list. The program you built is simply meant to automate the process of sending customized emails, not to send mass emails and spam people. You can always go back to the recipe builder and change the content of your email. Once again, any changes made to your Google Sheet will also be reflected in your Wayscript program as well. Congratulations on building your own customized email sender.